Now still within the music lane, streaming is no doubt the biggest form of distribution and consumption for recording artists after it has rendered physical sales of compact discs obsolete. Now, while it has eliminated the threat of piracy through physical sales, it has also created a new threat in the industry, stream farming. This is a process when an artist or its management manipulate the streaming numbers with the help of bits to either help the artist generate either mainstream attention or earn undeserving royalties from the various streaming platforms. In a quick chat with Entertainment News on China's television, Tyron Grandeur, an executive of digital distribution service, 1RPM, confirms that stream firming is beginning to rear its head within the Nigerian music space. Hear him. It's, it's a human factor. Wherever there is progress, there's always people who are willing to do certain things to beat the system to get ahead. Stream farming happens to be one of them. Um, thankfully, the company I represent, which is 1RPM, you know, is very strict on such, you know, and is able to curb a lot of that already. Um, because, you know, 1RPM prides itself as a company that is very transparent and, um, you know, keeps to the standards, right? But in terms of, I like to assume that it's not as prevalent as we think. I like to believe in the success of the Nigerian music industry. And you know, yeah, so there are some bad eggs, but um, you can see the global rise of Afrobeats. You can see it in the Grammy nominations we're getting. You can see it in, you know, Bonner Boy from, from Port Harcourt shutting down the O2 Arena and stadiums in the US, right? So there is obviously an appetite for Nigerian music. So I like to believe that a lot of it is legit. Um, but obviously there'll be some bad eggs and you know, what can we do? How prevalent is it? I can't I don't know a percentage, but I'm just saying um, No, but because you work in the industry, yeah. you will you will at least have a little bit of idea. I mean there is there is a percentage of people, I would say maybe there is twenty percent of people, you know, twenty, thirty percent. But I mean I, I prefer to focus on the positives of the industry and the stories that I mean the transformative stories of people who have come from nothing to something and you know worldwide acclaim. So yeah.